I love how slow he's like, boom. That weight too, that sounds like a good burger too. <laughs> yep, that's fantastic. That is fantastic. Like that's the thing with Karen's Diner, their food has to be amazing. Like no pressure, but like if your service is intentionally your food has to be so good where you're like, okay, it's worth it. But also this guy's so funny. This is like low key a dream job. Just go over and be like, hey, milkshake, awesome. Be so moody and you could just oh, lean into it. That's so funny. Everyone loves it too, they're all just filming. Oh, I like this place, I like this one. This is so funny. She's so good. That is so funny. I love that. Yes, okay, yes. These dudes walking in laugh, they're like, let's do it. I'm so pumped. Can you like not film me without my permission, please? I get Karen's coffee drinks. Thanks for covering my I love, I love where we've gotten to from like human beings. You know what I mean? Like, I'm old school. I remember listening to like Dane Cook make the Karen joke. The first Karen joke. He's the OG. No one's gonna forget this. I'm not letting anyone forget this. But he made the first one, and then now there's restaurants. And we've established like a new category of awful people. And it's the best. I love it. I love it. Oh my god. I heard about these bags. He's the best. What did this one say? First one said it should have swallowed a little bit. Oh, I can read that one, it's too fast. These are so inappropriate. Okay, yeah, it's pretty inappropriate. I don't know. This is amazing. Nice. The nonverbal. Yeah, I love that. Extra napkins, coming up hot, there you go. Boom, it's like a gentleman's club in LA at 2 a.m. Toss them up, like Cardi B in her old days. Throw them right up. Uh, yeah, I, I love this place. I love how people have just accepted and we're leaning into it. This is great, this is where we should be for all the things. Pissing off older white women in the meantime, let's do it. See, like, it's still service. It's still a busy restaurant with service. This is chaos. I honestly, like, it's fun, but like, man, I bet those servers are like, yo, I actually want to rip table 13. I actually want to rip their heads off. So I don't know what to do about this. But then you just lean into the character more, right? Like, what a dream scenario. I've served at numerous restaurants. It's horrible. People talk to you like I wish it could come out and be like, and just walk away. I wish you could tip ketchup on things, but here you go. Why didn't you order it then? Uh, there you go. Now you just do it. You get a tip for it. It's pretty sick. We have a nice system. We've created a nice system. I'm gonna keep doing this. Took my mum to Karen's, dying yes. telling her it was a normal restaurant. Okay. <laughs> yeah, this is amazing. No. <laughs> She's horrified. Poor lady. Okay, so they can go pretty far with these things. Uh, that's amazing. She's like. I'm coming back here next Tuesday. Let's make reservations on the way out. Birthdays, no problem. I'm definitely gonna go here for a birthday, for sure. See, I like getting roasted too, that's the thing. Like, I would go here, I enjoy getting roasted. I love, I mean, you know, some comments are mean and just heart, like, hurtful, whatever, but like, you know, Timothy Chalamet, if he didn't get cast in Dune, Chris D'Elia's non-famous weird brother. I like them, I like the subtle roasts, I enjoy them. In a restaurant setting, even better. While my face is full of meat and I'm chewing dinner and someone's roasting me, Dream come true. I feel like a king at a medieval diner, getting roasted. Oh, nice. 
Oh my god. <laughs> yeah, he got, he got got. He got got. <laughs> he loves it. He loves it. There's never been an experience like this in his life. I love it. I love it. I love it! I, his soul's happy. I, I, I can tell that his soul is just like, I like that. I like that. Why don't you swallow your food first? He's like, oh, you got me. You did get me. Yeah, that's a thing too. Serving tables, always nice. Complaining about the food as they're eating it and speaking to you at the same time. You're like, okay. Taking my Irish friend who has never I love this trend. Oh my God. <laughs> I'm so stressed. Why, why is he rolling you the honey? Oh, <laughs> oh my gosh, I love this. <laughs> I love. I, okay, I remember the first, no, the second time I went to Scotland, because I was open up to drink. Hey, hey, I went to a bar, and it was like a speakeasy type thing, and some guy with a, you know, cool spy mustache came around, like a bookshelf or whatever, with like a cool drink. He had like a glass thing, and he took it off, and it was all smoky, and he was like, mm, with this sh and he put it down. And then it was like, kind of like a, a rude restaurant like that, too. Like, he ordered, and he was like, go f yourself, or whatever. I don't know, I'm not gonna do the accent, because I don't want to get canceled, but. It, a lovely accent, the Irish accent, any accent accomplished, I don't know what I'm saying. But the accent definitely makes it um, funnier by, by every mean. Karen's and gentle Karen's is 9.56. We close in four minutes. So it's time to finish up your food and get the f out. Because it's Sunday night and I want to go to bed. Yeah? I don't care if you're still eating. I don't care if you're still drinking. Go leave us a hefty tip and off, yeah? This is amazing. Cool? Great. Sorted. Get out. <laughs> Sorted. Right. Get out. This is amazing. This is like, also, what a hard job to do. Like, I can stand here and talk and say things. I have a prompter that I resort to. I react to shit. It's easy. It's fun. There's just lights here. No one's around. This is a hard job. Having to like do this after a shift. Also, after you've worked a serving shift, still getting on a mic and being in character and being on like a Karen, whatever. Kudos. This is a hard job. And like, they have to clean their shit up after too. What about me? It's fucking coming, wait for time. <laughs> She's so good. <laughs> Take a chip and piss off. Oh my God. I'm going now, I'm going now, I'm sorry. Get out of our shop. That is so funny. Oh, the bed. That is so funny. God. Like, they're good. They're comics. These, oh, they're all comics. They're all so funny. That's like on the spot, roasting people. That is so hard to do. While you're holding a tray of like actual hot food, real food that you have to deliver, that has to be quality, arguably one of the hardest restaurants. And they're nailing it. Uh, in the UK, we did have a Yeah, we do. Wow. 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 <laughs> no, I'm just like, yep. This is the best. <laughs> this is so satisfying. I would just want to go and just be a fly. Just be a fly on the wall. Actually, no, that'd be kind of gross. A fly in a restaurant. It's the last place you want to see flies. I want to just go and just sit at a table. Not even order, just sit and be like, just talk that. Roast me. I want you to roast me like one of your French girls. Let me eat my soup of the day while you roast me. That was great. Those were uh, Karen's, Karen's Diner. Some TikToks at Karen Diner. Karen's, old Karen's Diner. I'm gonna lean in and uh, those are the best Karen Diner TikToks. There we go. I remember that when I walked in. Uh, yeah, comment down, like and subscribe. You know the drill. If you wanna see more, tell us what you wanna see. I don't know. You wanna see some like kickflips? I don't know. Chris, can you do kickflip? Yeah. yeah, I can maybe still do one. Kyle can't. He says he can, but I know he can't. All right, see you guys next time. I'm Chandler McWaters. Bye.
Hair's getting long, I gotta cut it again. If this video gets a million views, uh, I'll just shave all my hair off, I'll do it. My hair's bugging me, I don't like this haircut. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Okay. This is some Karen's Diner. It's a diner where people just are rude, where servers are intentionally rude to you. They come over, they're like, yeah, what do you want? And they're all rude. I guess, I don't know. I heard a guy got fired because he was like too mean two weeks ago, so that's fun. There's a line, there's a line, apparently, and he found it two weeks ago. I think he asked someone eating a grilled cheese about OnlyFans or something, and then the family's like, okay, that's a bit, you know, ask about birthdays, do some improv, let's not get a little gross at the table. We're still trying to eat. So yeah, Karen's Diner. I wanna go here, apparently it's somewhere in the US. I'm like, hey, and that's 10 minutes, sorry, I've talked it off, here we go. Oh, it's so good. I wanna like go here, but I would get too jealous. Like the performer side of me would wanna just work there, you know what I mean? I wouldn't wanna just watch some guy. This is a dream job. I might, this might be my last shift. I don't know, I'm watching this, I'm like, this is a hard sell, this looks good. This is a restaurant Karens can't go to, it's the best part. Like you genuinely can't be a Karen at this restaurant. What do you do though, if like there's bad service, like if like the food's raw or something, like, well obviously you're not gonna Karen out, but like, I would hate complaining, because I'm like, oh, don't give me the smoke, but actually, it's raw, please. Please don't yell at me, Ooh, it's raw. I love this. I watched 50 of these. Any coffee? Any coffee in the morning? <sighs> Work out as Tim's today. Jacked up, it's a Monday move. It's a Monday move. Boss is getting us coffee, they know what's up on a Monday. They're like, get to it, get hyped. A lot of Karens coming in hot. I'm gonna do a roast for my birthday this year. <laughs> might just do that. You're doing a lot, there's a lot of layers to this job that a lot of people are overlooking. From the, from the, uh, you can't even talk, it's a hard it is. From the performer server side, mixed in together. At the same time too, impressive.